here it is. We're a week away from the 4th of July. It's summertime is here. We've got the last unicorn here at South Mountain Yachts. It's a 2005 300 Sea Ray Sundancer, very well powered with twin Merc Cruiser 350 mags and Bravo 3 out drives. She's loaded with generator, air conditioning, great electronics, full camper back, and ready to rock and roll. So come with me for this quick walkthrough tour on this boat here at South Mountain Yachts. Here we are starting off forward starboard bow on this 300 Sea Ray Sundancer. We've got a nice delta plow anchor, nighttime spotlight, windlass with foot pedals and remote control. Coming down along the side, we see we've got some nice fender baskets and a great LLI, ladies like it, feature. You can have a sun pad made for that foredeck, just lay out on that. We also have a paddle board holder right there. So she's ready to go for lots of fun. Coming down along the side, we see we've got that Taylor curved windshield, which adds a sporty look and a full camper canvas right there. Here is our Sundancer badge. We've also added a few rocket launchers for the guys that like to fish. And our camper camp back is up. Here at the transom, we have an extended swim platform with lots of features. Here we are on the extended swim platform on this 30 Sea Ray Sun Dancer. We see right in front of us, we've got trunk storage right there, stereo controls right there, and an in-deck boarding ladder. Now for those of us that like fishing, we have our bait tank right there. We enter the cockpit through this port side door and immediately off to starboard we see we've got a nice u-shaped seating area we've got a cocktail table all set up now there also is a filler board that goes across there so you can break down the table and make it into a large sun pad there's also storage up under this seat right here for life jackets and everything else. As we circle around on port side, we see we've got a nice wet bar right here with a refrigerator and sink with storage underneath. If you notice, Sea Ray does an excellent job. We've got lots of grab rails and cup holders. Now here at the helm, we have a double wide seat with thigh rise bolsters so you can drive standing up or sitting down. Underneath, we've got a lot of good storage right there. And check out those speakers for our stereo. Here at the helm, we have our classic Sea Ray leather wrapped steering wheel that does tilt. We've got our Raymarine VHF radio, stereo control right there, driver controls the stereo, our touchpad electronics there, nice Raymarine system, dual shift and throttles right here. And then up above, we have our 4-in-1 C-Ray gauges, our tax, miles per hour, and our port side gauges. Our line of sight features a compass and right out to the bow. This is going to give us a cockpit overview right here. And there we go. Engine access is through this hydraulic hatch right there. With the touch of a button, up she goes. view of our engine compartment. Right in front of us we see a pair of Merc Cruiser 350 mags that power the Bravo 3's outdrive right there. Right below us we've got four new batteries. They were just put in probably within the month 
and then our 5kW generator is right here. This gives us a nice overview of the engine compartment. Risers look good, manifolds look good, nice and clean. Belts appear to be in good condition. Other than that, we're all set. Once we do a quick inspection, with the push of a button, just drop the hatch and we're ready to go. We enter the cabin through this center line door and down a few steps. Right before us, we get an overview of the cabin, which is very nicely appointed and fully air conditioned. Immediately to port, we have our head. Very nice. It's an LLI, ladies like it feature, fully lined fiberglass with a separate shower curtain, easy to keep neat easy to keep clean. The shower is RV style, just pull it out. We've got a nice mirror there also. Moving forward, we've got the galley down below, refrigerator, drawer storage, and a couple tall cabinets. We've got a formed in Corian style countertop and a dual burner stove right here above we've got more storage here and we also have a microwave and a little cabinet right there for our glasses ta uh, tableware etc etc we also have another storage shelf right here nice feature here we've got the port lights right up above and there's fillers so we can darken the cabin should we want to. This cabin is fully lined with a marine grade vinyl, so she's easy to care for, easy to clean. Moving forward, we see we've got a pull out TV. It swivels so everyone can actually view it and a DVD player right there. Looking forward, we have our very large slant bed right there it's over seven feet tip to tip so uh, the tall guys can actually enjoy it there's gunnel storage there and a nice hatch up above over here we have a nice hanging locker and of course a privacy curtain of course it's a boat not a lot of privacy on there coming down along the starboard side we see upper gunnel cabinets for storage we have a nice dinette here. Now, the lower portion actually slides out. Remove the table, slide the lower portion out, and you've got sleeping space for two more folks. Moving aft, we see we have an alarm system on the vessel. Then right in here, we have our power panel that actually has our stereo, tank level indicator, all of our switches, AC, DC, our ignitions inside, and then we have our generator start right there also. We've got a few drawers down below for extra storage. Here we are. As we move aft, we have this nice full-size mid-cabin here, which we currently have set up as a seating area. She converts into a bed. which is good for at least two adults. Some other features in here, we've got some additional gunnel storage, mirrored locker, and off in the corner, we have a nice DVD TV player and an extra set of life jackets right there. Circling forward, we see we have nice open steps so visibility is complete throughout the cabin. And here we are. This vessel is neat, clean, odor-free, air-conditioned, 
ready to go, viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.